my channel welcome i hope by the end of this video you join the team and become a subscriber um we back with another vlog y'all i'm currently about to go to the movies on a solo date so um i am on break right now from pa school before our fall semester starts i'm trying to pull this chair down but i can't go down anymore um but yeah i'm on break right now so i wanted to like really occupy myself and just get like my mental physical emotional health just together and just like really try to enjoy myself for these two weeks because when i tell y'all fall semester is going to be gruesome it's going to be gruesome like i really felt like the summer was already bad enough but it only gets more intense the best thing about the whole um experience as being a student is that like you know you face more challenges but as you go through the process you learn new skills and like how to like overcome the challenges so it kind of like prepares you for the next if you get what i'm saying so yeah i'm currently about to go to the movies it starts at 12. um i was looking at the movie theater food and i'm kind of not feeling it so i think i might get food elsewhere but i don't know because there's traffic and i have to look for parking and if you live in new york city you know how that goes but um yeah so that's the plan for today um this is gonna be like a week vlog i am wearing this two-piece set from shein y'all i have so much laundry that i have to do oh and this is a plant that i got from um ikea another thing that i'm really trying to do during this break well tomorrow because i have an assignment that's due tonight so let me just give y'all a rundown of what we're gonna do today so we're going to the movie theaters we're gonna go see the oppenheimer movie um i love like war i used to always watch war documentary type of movies like especially on netflix um so i'm excited to see that movie and then um i'm gonna go to ikea because i need a replacement piece for my mom dresser i set up that dresser by myself and I did good for a person who never set up anything before I even set up my vanity but um, a lot of pieces and stuff like had to be altered so yeah I had to get um, a piece because I put a lot of stuff in my drawer and it ended up breaking so yeah I gotta go to Ikea hopefully they have that replacement piece for me and then I also have to oh I want to go to this market it's called Bob that ballady market it's a halal type of market they sell halal food they sell um arabian perfumes and stuff like that so i'm excited to go there and then also i wanted to go to aldo's but we're gonna see because it's in that area i was just gonna go get that out the way because i do need like casual shoes like espadrilles espadrilles yeah or like flats um because it's flats and espadrilles espadrilles the flats that i currently have right now they're a little too big for me so they flop off my feet and I hate that when I'm walking so yeah I have to do that and then later on we're gonna submit uh, um, my last assignment of the semester so technically my semester is done but we just have one more assignment due that I didn't even start yet it's like a two-page reflection paper so I'm gonna get that out the way and just submit that because it's due tomorrow morning be on the lookout for more videos from my summer semester make sure you turn on your post notifications so you can be alerted and let's roll so I made it to the spot i didn't take my camera when i went inside but uh this car is blocking but the spot is on hoyt street it's not the mexican spot it's the spot that's two spots to the left <laughs> um i'm gonna show y'all the food so this is how the food looks oh my god i got the catfish dinner with collard greens but i meant to order spinach um mac and cheese it looks so good and it's so huge and i also got um there's sweet potatoes because I heard it's also good. So I can't wait to eat this up. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Guys, y'all are not going to believe what happened. So, uh, 
but um i make it to the movie theater and i get there at like about 12 uh, 12 40 12 50 i want to say what time is it no maybe like 12 40 i get to inside the theater probably like around that time um because i had to find parking and downtown brooklyn is probably the downtown brooklyn is the worst place to find parking honestly i feel like in the city you're more likely to find a spot rather than downtown brooklyn it's just so congested oh so annoying but i finally found the spot and um i go to the movie theaters i get there late but i just go inside like nobody's like scanning barcodes but i sit down um i bring i ring the bell because they have like a dining um thing like how i pick does um and i'm waiting to order my stuff and the guy's like oh we don't like talk here we write so like he showed me the paper and pen and then next thing i know a lady asked me to step out the movie theater so i'm like what the freak like what is going on why did she ask me to step out did i do something i mean i did i actually um didn't sit in the exact spot that i bought because i seen people were like already sitting in a row and i didn't want to go in front of them so i just sat in like an empty area so i show her my ticket and she says she there's a strict policy that specifically says if you're late you cannot sit and watch the movie and to me i feel like that's so annoying and dumb because be for real like people are going to come late things happen like what the hell um but yeah she told me that that's their strict policy um because um it kind of like interferes with people enjoying their movie when people come in late and like you know that's a they're they are a different theater compared to like amc and you know regal cinemas and all of that so i get it it's whatever um yeah but that really 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 pissed me off because i really wanted to watch that movie um but i was just like it's just a sign it's not bad for me to watch the movie <laughs> i'm just gonna probably try to find um a link online that lets me watch it i did get a refund and she did give me like a free popcorn voucher for when i return if i return yeah i'm about to chop down this food that i bought y'all i never had catfish before well at least not to my knowledge and this is so good oh my god literally 10 out of 10 from the fish to the sides oh my god i didn't even try the sweet potatoes so good y'all mm -mm. now that i think about it i do have to do a whole two-page paper so honestly i think that it's okay that i didn't um that i wasn't able to watch the movie because <laughs> i still have to do that paper So good, y'all. All right, you guys. So I made it to IKEA. Hopefully, they have the replacement piece that I need. Um, yeah, we'll see if they do. I just love the decor. Today's escalator isn't working. Surprisingly. Rachel, so I got the pieces. Um, the man, hold on. The man was so nice. Did I park this way? No, I didn't. The man was so nice. Um, I was actually gonna get one, but then I got two just in case, like another um part of my drawer um breaks because I do put a lot of stuff in the drawer and I'm gonna try not to. And it's specifically the drawer that I have with like my hijabs and head scarves inside. So <laughs> that just goes to show like i just have mad at them but um i just left i'm i'm gonna go to the um Bilotti market the market that i was telling you guys about earlier and um i looked up some tiktok perfumes that i want to try so we're gonna see how those perfumes smell in person hopefully they have them um i was gonna go to ikea but i mean ikea i was gonna go to aldo's but honestly i'm not gonna go anymore because I'm just 
kind of like over it and I have so much to do I want to do my laundry and then I still have to like start my assignment <laughs> that I didn't start yet so it's like I have a lot to do so I'm just gonna do that and yeah mm -hmm. Ugh. okay they fit perfectly my car smells like mad catfish y'all my car smells like mad catfish right now and y'all it's so much traffic when i tell y'all who honestly like living in new york city driving in new york city is like so annoying like why is it gonna take me 45 minutes to get from the marketplace to my house and and like it's in the same borough like there should be no way and like that's literally like me going from the city to my house no from the city to my house right now would probably be like an hour and change but yo like ugh, it's just ridiculous you guys all right you guys so i made it to the place and it has so much different types of perfume I see the one that I want. Yeah. I'm about to just look around and smell a few. Or like fruity. Yeah. Yeah. It might be a little too. Fruity. Okay. No, this is too strong. Yeah. I want something less. Okay, so I just left the marketplace. Um, I actually went to the supermarket um by accident and then they directed me to the place where um they sell the perfumes which is like next door um from the supermarket though i got this yemen tea hopefully you guys can see um yeah i'm about to try it but i got that and then i got two different perfumes um i'll unbox that when i get home mm. this is okay it's just not sweet i'm gonna have to add some simple um vanilla syrup in there when i get home but yeah i'm about to head home right now all right y'all so i'm running out of gas and i am about to fill my tank up Because I'm very much confused. Oh. Hold up, because we're about to see. What the hell? Okay, so I could have sworn I selected regular gas, so there should be no reason. Let me zoom out. No, no, why? I was so close. I could have sworn I selected regular gas, so it should be no reason why I paid $62. But, <laughs> whatever. Your girl is back home and I'm about to do an unboxing. So firstly, I got this keychain. Um, this is so cute. Basically, it's a keychain where um, you can pour oil inside. And um, you see this, you could just roll it onto your skin. I don't have any oils, which I should have bought while I was there. Silly me. But I think my mom does, so I'm going to pour some inside and then attach it to my keychain. And then I'm gonna unbox this perfume first. This is the Yara perfume. I've seen this perfume so much on TikTok. I was like, I have to smell it. And it smells so good in person. Oh my God, this bottle is so cute. Oh my God, I love the bottle. I love, love, love. Okay, let's smell. Ooh. <laughs> I think... I, I inhaled it through my nose too much it burnt a little a tad bit on the strong side but nothing too crazy which I like I don't like strong perfumes I feel like that's just too much but yeah I love this I'm trying to figure out how I close this so I got this other perfume which is called Lams Alhu I hope I'm pronouncing it right this one has like a more it's not really fruity but it is more on the stronger side but it gives like grown women like 
y'all probably like how the hell is she um describing these perfumes and how the hell am i supposed to picture it smelling but it smells strong um not too strong enough where like you'll want to run away if that makes sense but i like it it's it smells like i don't know how to i really don't know how to describe but like it, it smells like grown woman to me like it gives that grown woman type of scent also try their yummy tea from the supermarket that's right next door um i added some simple vanilla syrup once i got home i'm about to taste it now to see if it tastes better it's all right nothing too crazy to brag on if you like yummy tea try it right now i'm about to pray then settle down get myself like a little you know just relaxing type of period and then get to work i have to start my um reflection paper i have to also do laundry and i also have to um oh i also have to fix my drawers so let me show y'all what's going on so right now all of my hijabs are in this plastic bag because literally what this right here was under, like it was the base of the drawer and it held all my scarves, but it ended up breaking and um, it was because it was a lot of stuff. So basically what I'm gonna do is take out some hijabs that I don't wear anymore and then um, put the new piece that I got on um, back into the drawer, reinstall it, and then um, put everything back. But that's after I do my laundry because I also have some hijabs there too. So I want to just do everything all at once. Check out these flowers that I got. Um, oh my god, they're dying. But um, I've been doing good at keeping flowers. I think this is just away from the sun in my room, so that's probably why it's not lasting long. But they're so beautiful. I'm gonna insert a picture of how they looked before. I don't know if it's a flowers or if it's just the way that I was taking care of them because everything keeps shedding. But yeah, I'm going to change the water and put them back inside. Okay, you guys, so I made it to my Pilates class. Um, this is my second class so far, and I love the studio. It's really nice. Um, I just got ready. I'm about to put my grip socks on, and yeah, I'm going to start. I did not know that McDonald's sell lemonade. It's so good, y'all. Like, what the hell? Why am I just learning about this? Once I get home, I am going to, um, or oh, I have to clean my room. I have to, I have to, um, fix my dresser. I was supposed to do that last night, but I was caught up doing my assignment, so I didn't get time to do that. So, I gotta clean my room, fix my dresser. Mmm, I have to edit my youtube video so i could post this week and by the time that you'll see this vlog it'll be up so i'll link it above so you guys can watch that 
and yeah um that's pretty much it for the rest of my night tomorrow i have some things planned oh my god i have a cycle bar class oh cycle bar is very challenging but the um the drill and like the uh oh my gosh but i'm gonna go tomorrow i have a class with them um the only thing is after my first class with them my glutes was hurting so bad like it was so sore from like sitting on a bike um <laughs> anytime i would get tired i would sit my backpack down on a bike <laughs> hey y'all so today is friday um i did not vlog yesterday honestly i was not in the mood my body was super duper sore from that pilates class um that class that i took with that instructor was not even nowhere near close beginner friendly so i played myself but it was a really good workout and she was really nice she helped me so um shout out to her um i'm really debating so today is friday today is juma if you don't know what juma is i'll insert the definition so i'm on my way right now to this cafe um near this mosque that i'm gonna go to the cafe is called cafe kitsume i think that's how you pronounce it they actually own a, a few cafes like in new york city um i believe like there's two or one in um, manhattan somewhere like near soho or something like that um i wanted to go there for a while um i'm in my cafe era so if you guys know any cafes that are really good for studying or just like vibes or just like their coffee is really good let me know um i'm trying to like try different cafes and stuff like that i've seen them on tiktok and um they are laptop free so you can't really study there i bought my ipad just in case they allow me to use my ipad but um, i plan on getting like um a little coffee drink because i need something to keep me a little going and i'm also gonna like um read this book called majestic quran it's basically like the translation of the quran and then i'm gonna go to juma prayer and after that um I am debating on whether or not I want to do this Pilates class. It's at 3 o'clock. Juma is probably going to end at 2. I didn't book the class yet. But I'm kind of waiting until 1 o'clock. And like if the class is unbookable by then, then oh wow, like so be it. Then I'm just going to take it as a sign. Um, right now, I'm not as sore as I was yesterday. Alhamdulillah. But um, I'm just a little nervous because I really don't want to like go and then like I don't know I, I'm gonna see cuz this instructor that I'm um, trying to take the class with she's actually more on the beginner friendly um, side if you guys are wondering how I'm booking all of these classes I book it through this app called class pass it's really good I'm gonna leave my link down below so that you guys can get free credits when you guys sign up it's a really good app y'all y'all have to check it out I even had to reschedule my cycle bar class which was supposed to be yesterday just because like my body was so sore but today I'm feeling much better so I might just end up in that class but yeah
So you guys, they have this beautiful um, little exhibit here. Looks so amazing. I'm walking to the mass right now. And this drink is actually better than I expected. Honestly, y'all, like, I'm super duper surprised. Because I usually go for ice drinks, and this is actually good. It's bitter than I usually get my drinks, my lattes. <laughs> but it's actually still good. So, I don't know. I'm really becoming a coffee girl. <laughs> and I read some Quran. Uh, now I'm about to go to like a pier. About to leave the masjid right now. Salaamu Alaikum. Salaamu Alaikum. Make sure you guys go to me. Yeah. Right now, I'm about to go to like this pier. It's Manhattan. It's called Manhattan Bridge Lookout, I believe. Um, yeah, it looked really nice. I kind of just want to go enjoy the view of the water and like journal. So I'm going to do that. And then I actually ended up booking the Pilates class because a spot opened up for the 4 p.m. class. The 3 p.m. class was canceled and a spot opened up for the 4 p.m. class. So I just <laughs> impulsively booked it. I'm not sore anymore but i'm just hoping that like um once i get home later i'm hoping that i can manage to also work out on my treadmill because with pilates like i really feel like it's just like a good stretch for me but in terms of like cardio and like me sweating it doesn't really make me sweat a lot so um yeah i need that extra boost let me do a quick fit check for you guys so i got this Hopefully you guys can hear me, but I got this Abaya from Nabira. I actually mentioned them in one of my vlogs. I think it was, I'm going to link it above because I don't remember the title of the vlog. But this is how it looks. And I also have this tote from Shein. It basically says The weekend, And yeah, that's what I'm wearing. So I'm about to head to the Pierre place right now. Oh my gosh, you guys, this bus is like trying to turn, but it's like hard for him or her. If you could drive a bus or a truck, I salute you because it is very like hard. Like, oh my God, that man is so nice. He's helping him. Oh gosh. Oh. So y'all, do y'all see the bus? I had to make a U-turn and just like reverse backwards to find parking. But the bus made it through because that car that was double parked finally moved. Oh my God, is it raining? But, um, oh my God, look at the view. This view is so beautiful. It's amazing. I got my tripod because I'm making a TikTok. Make sure you guys go follow me on there. This color on me and the sunlight is so cute. I love it. If I had time, I would have just really like sat down and like really journaled and just like, I don't know, just express my feelings. Cause I don't know, like right now, 
the mood, the weather, like it's not too hot. But um, yeah, I'm about to head to my Pilates class because it's gonna be traffic and I don't wanna get there late. But um, yeah, that pretty much sums up what I'm about to do right now. So it's the following day um, after Pilates, which kicked my butt. That session was really good. I'm glad I went. But after that, I pretty much um, got ready for today's activities, which includes me filming. So I booked this pair space, which is absolutely gorgeous. Oh my God, this interior. Oh, so beautiful. And comes with so much equipment like she had the lighting I brought my ring light but I don't even need to use it because um, literally everything is available they have lights up there and then you can adjust it with this tablet which is pretty cool um, it also has a full body mirror hey <laughs> um, and this also too I'm not gonna film in this area but um, So I plan on filming two, well, basically three different halls. One of them is a Shein hall, one of them is a Figs hall, and then the other is um, a PA school supply hall. So yeah, a lot of that. <laughs> um, I only have two and a half hours, well, less than that because it's, I don't even know where I put my phone at. But um, time is ticking, so I have to get moving. that drink i'm super duper upset that they didn't have like matcha or ice chai or chai like period they don't do that they only do teas and just like i guess black coffee i don't know i mean it was good i'm not really like a straight coffee type of person like i like matcha chai like i'm into those type of drinks but this was okay i got like a ice mocha with um oat milk and i added some honey into it um oh my god i was so pissed off though because it was super duper 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 packed um yeah the coffee tastes fresh though it does but i wanted to like sit down and edit my youtube video which i was unable to do i feel like this cafe is pretty much better to visit like on weekdays if you're trying to study or do work i don't even know if it's like a studyable type of cafe <laughs> i be making out words what is studyable but um yeah so i'm gonna come back here though like dur sometime during next week and i want to like try to edit a vlog here i think on weekends too they don't have um internet i don't know it was one cafe i was looking at and they said weekends they don't do cafes but um currently i'm waiting for my friends we're going to smorgasburg i think i told you guys earlier um it ends at 6 it's 4 15 we were scheduled to meet up at 2 30 and i was already in williamsburg you guys know that i filmed videos at this peer space studio and it was so beautiful oh uh, that's a story for another day but stay tuned for those videos make sure you turn on post notifications but um yeah i was 
already in Williamsburg, so it literally took me 20 minutes to get here. So I got here like probably like around 2.45, 3 o'clock, and look at the time. Ugh, so annoying. I'm always an early bird, and they're always late. But y'all meet them in a few. All right, guys, so I'm with my friend, Shanae. Y'all never met Shanae before, but y'all have met Jessica. Turn the hell around. <laughs> Y'all met Jessica before in one of my vlogs. Um, and then OJ and Alpha. Oh my god, my stomach. Oh my god. Oh, I smell it. Ooh, that Jamaican food smell good. Right? Like, yeah, I'm stopping it. That ain't cool. I had some jerk chicken taco. That shit's slap. That sounds mad good right now. I tried that last year though. I don't know what that means. what you in the mood, bro? I was looking at the Brazilian shit, but now I gotta look for something else. Cause he that ass right about that even all this shit. Ooh. Damn, there's mad different options. What? What are we feeling for? I think I want burria tacos. I want something spicy. I want burria tacos. This is too much. I'm mad in this ice. Is that shit burria tacos? That shit funny. So first stop we get at Rooster Boy. They got Japanese fried chicken. It's good. About to try barbecue tacos. Oh dang! You didn't like rich stuff? No, what? It's good. So this is what OJ brought. A tablecloth. The party tablecloth as a picnic seating. He tried. I can give that to him. Kalani! Kalani love. Look at me. She want her snacks. Oh, but the thing with that, the reason like uh, uh, I'm cool off of that right now, I need to... Have some shit that's really gonna work? Nah. the part ways with my friends. Say bye!
Hey y'all, I'm back home now. My makeup is like completely sweated off. I look a mess. Smorgasburg was so fun. I really had so much fun. The food was so good. They have a variety of options. Um, I did go to the Williamsburg one. I guess like each day they do different locations. So I think Fridays is like Road Trade Center. Saturday is Domino Park around that area. And then Sundays is Prospect Park. Um, it's pretty good. Like I recommend everyone to go. Um, it's vibes, like vibes on top of vibes. Me and my friends really enjoy myself. I feel like I don't be with my friends anymore ever since I started school. So like this was like a perfect, you know, get together type of thing. I'm really glad me and my friends got time to hang out. I'm about to jump in the shower and go straight to bed. My room is such a freaking mess, but I'm gonna leave that till tomorrow to handle. Tomorrow's Sunday, so I'm gonna do like a whole reset. I'm starting a new vlog tomorrow um so be on the lookout for that um and yeah this vlog is pretty darn long but i hope that you guys watched it through in full and i really hope that you guys enjoy if you aren't already subscribed make sure you subscribe to my channel and be on the lookout for all the videos that i'm gonna be dropping thank you guys so much and i'll see you guys in my next vlog